Hey guys, welcome back to chapter four of the 3D printing workshop. Now we've covered a lot of information so far and I hope that you're enjoying yourself and keeping up with no problems whatsoever. We're gonna learn how to diagnose and fix some quality problems with our 3D prints. Now we're gonna cover some really basic stuff. Now I think it's important to get our mindset right for this chapter and for the rest of our 3D printing life. Now what do I mean by that? Well, 3D printing essentially just takes a lot of time to get used to and a bit of knowledge. Now following along, along with our workshops is gonna go miles in helping you to make sure that you're prepared and knowledgeable for the problems that you encounter, but you're still going to encounter those problems. So the key thing is to know that every single time you print something and there's something wrong with it, there's a story behind that. And that, that story is fixable and you will fix it, but you've got to overcome that. So the best fix to these issues is to do isolated printer tests before we start printing crazy difficult models. We can fine tune and get a real sense for each of those problems. And then we can move forward into printing some awesome looking models knowing what's going on behind the printer. So let's start off with looking at some of the common issues that we run into with 3D printing. 